Hi there. Uh, we are here now to make an interview with one of our Secretary Generals, uh, Benjamin. So, hi Benjamin, could you uh, introduce yourself to us firstly? Um, hello, I'm Benjamin. Please just call me Ben. As I've already said, I'm one of the Secretary Generals for this year's Siegmund 2016. And I've been with Mod United Nations since my first conference in 2014. Um, so, can you talk about uh, more of your experiences in the previous years? Like, what has been directing you to Zigemion, uh, beginning from 2014? Well, when I first did a Muslim United Nations conference, I really wanted to make some new friends and just try something different. Because I find a lot of what we do at university is quite static. I sat in a, sat in a room just listening to somebody talk to us. Whereas with Muslim United Nations, you can really do something yourself and really become active in what you're doing. With regards to my previous experiences with MUN over the last couple of years, as I said, I first started in 2014, and that went really well because I was able to work with the chairs to, to develop my ideas, and I won a Best Delegate Award. To my surprise at the time, I didn't think I was that good, but obviously I must have been pretty good. And then afterwards, as I said in my speech, I was asked to be a, be a head delegate for New York, where we were going to represent the Sultanate of Oman I at NMUN which is the world's largest Model United Nations conference. It's also the most prestigious. The closing ceremony actually takes place in the General Assembly Hall of the United Nations, so that was really exciting. And the closing speaker was actually um, a Samantha Power. She's one of the United States representatives to General Assembly 6, the legal committee. So that was really exciting. I could talk about this all day, to be honest with you. But um, yeah, Sultanate of Oman, it went really well. At the beginning, I didn't know how to be a very good head delegate, but I was lucky to be paired with Moritz Limbacher, who was, had more experience with Mod United Nations, and by working together very closely, we were really able to prepare the team to represent the Sultanate of Oman. And we actually managed to win some awards at this international conference for the first time in university history, so that was really exciting for us. We weren't necessarily ex expecting to win any awards, so to get anything at all was just amazing. Um, I'm not very good at talking about myself, but I was actually representing the Sultanate of Oman in UNDP with my co-delegate, Remy, and we actually won a best delegate not a best delegate, a best position paper award in that committee. So I was really proud that year. That's really great. Um, next, I wanted to ask you uh, what kind of differences you see between this year's conference and last year's, and uh, what are your expectations from that differences? Okay, well, one of the major differences this year is that this year is a very multilingual um, conference. In the previous years, we only had, last year we had one committee in Spanish, which was quite small. And then the years before, we only had committees in English. So that's definitely a large change that we're doing everything in a much more multilingual style, which I feel better reflects the reality of international diplomacy. The United Nations, for example, has six main languages upon which people can speak. So there's a lot of translation there. Another big difference, I think, is that it's just grown in size and number. I mean, we've, as Garrett Porsche said, this conference first started in 2009 with only two committees. And yet today, we now have seven. So I feel it just keeps growing in scale and size, and I'm really happy to see that. In terms of what I expect from this conference, I, um, what I'm really looking forward to is seeing people who've perhaps never done modern United Nations before sort of fall in love with United Nations, just like I did two years ago. I'm really looking forward to seeing people develop their speaking skills, grow in confidence, and hopefully make lots of new friends and have experiences they can cherish in the future. Thank you very much. Thank you.